Hello everyone, uh, today we'll be unboxing the Canon Vixia HF S10 or the S100, uh, which is the same but just doesn't have a internal memory. So first off here we have the manual and some CDs, a really thick manual right here, the Vixia S10. Pretty much the same manual for the S100 as well. Here we have some CDs, pixel application, it's another disc 2, the Canon CD, and the digital video CD, and some warranty and paper stuff. Alright, next, let's see. We have the power brick right there and this end connects to the camcorder next we have the let's see the power cord itself which connects into the power brick like that it plugs into the wall there we go Next, what it's included with is a USB cable. Plugs into your computer and plugs into your camcorder. If you have a Mac, it should automatically just pop up. You don't need to install any of the CDs at all. It should be preloaded into all Macs. iMovie, Final Cut Express. RCA cable and a component cable for HD TVs. And we have a remote with battery. Next is the camcorder itself. Some stats on it will be in my next part of the video, but here's a quick look at it. Uh, I put the battery in just before to charge it so I can test it later. So it's a pretty small battery, two hour battery life or less. I bought an extra battery. But here it is, a quick look, and uh, in the next part of my video, we'll take a deep, deeper inside and maybe some stats. That's a SD card holder, but it already has internal memory, so I won't really use it. But here is the camera itself, a huge lens in the front, which will really help with my recording, for, especially for low light situations. First off, just some little things. This is the S10, so internal flash drive, 32 gigs, or a SDHS or HC memory card. Okay, some things on the back. Just turn it on for you guys. While I go through this, it's a total pixel is 8.59. The video is approximately 6.01. And compared to the other high models like the M31 and the HV40, those have 3 to 4 megapixels and they run around $1,000, $900. So this I think was the, the best from Canon that offered the highest resolution. And this is the camera mode. It has a pop-up flash when you push the camera button. There it is. The screen is very nice. It has like a anti-glare or anti-smudge filming on it. I put a UV lens on it just to protect it from dust and stuff. It doesn't come with a lid or anything. That's where you connect to your computer. And the little tabs I was just touching were the AV and the DC in. This lens doesn't come with it, but you can find it pretty cheap at any electronic store, camera store. That is the manual mode, custom mode. I set it to custom focus. You can, it's a little roller, and these are the dual speakers excellent sound 
and the bottom's pretty bare. Has a little tripod connector, but that's it. But yeah, that's the shoe right there, and then the zoom. Yeah. That's it, guys. Thanks.